Okay, so in this lab, we are going to be extracting DNA from a banana, right? And there's a couple steps that we're going to go through. So the first step is we're going to mush that banana because what we want to do is uh, essentially destroy those cells to be able to access the DNA. If you remember, the DNA is that hereditary molecule that is locked up inside of the nucleus. So... That first process you see, we're gonna mush the banana. Then we add salt water. And that is an important step because that salt is gonna help that DNA, those DNA molecules combine into clumps that we can see. From there, we add a little bit of dish soap. Now the dish soap, uh, if you think about why you use dish soap, it's to help kind of cut the grease or cut the fat on your dishes. Well, um, your cells have, if you guys remember, they have your cell membrane and they also have a nuclear membrane. And both of those are lipids. Lipids are fats. So the addition of the dish soap is going to help break down those membranes that freeze up the uh, DNA now, right? So then we put it through a coffee filter to strain it and we retain the larger molecules and the DNA flows through the coffee filter along with some other stuff. And lastly, we add alcohol and that alcohol is gonna form a layer on the top. Now DNA is soluble in water, so it will break down in water, but it won't in alcohol. So that alcohol helps um, kind of keep that DNA clumped together and lets us actually see it. So that's the idea behind what we're doing. Uh, you can watch the video now and see the process. I'll have a link to a uh, website where if you want to actually do this yourselves, you can. Uh, I have my nieces in this video as my lab assistants. Uh, they did a pretty good job. All right, say hi, Wins. Hi. Hi, all right. I'm here with my lab assistant and we are gonna extract DNA from a banana. Are you ready? Okay, so first, take your banana, and you want half a banana, and you're gonna put it in a baggie, like so. All right, Wayne, this is your, where I need you to work. Now, can you mush this? So keep it in the bag and just mush it like that. Can you do that? There yeah, you go, yeah, yeah, squeeze it. It's kind of fun, right? So while she does that, we need half a cup of water. And you have a, I have a teaspoon, oh good job. I have a teaspoon of salt dissolved in it. Teaspoon? Teaspoon, teaspoon yeah. So you mush it like that. Make sure I have the structure. So you wanna mush it until all the lumps are gone, right? See how it's still lumpy? Yeah, we wanna, we wanna, exactly. Yeah, it's a little lumpy right now. Part of that because I got some air in there. Let's get the air out. Oh, yeah. Now we're mushing that lump one press down. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Yeah, you're in our video now. She is or I am? <laughs> we, we, she is. She's my assistant. Can you can join us. You got your own water. Okay. So now that you've mushed the banana so there's no lumps, good job. We're gonna yeah, add. Can she can come in if she wants. <laughs> is this a video? Yeah. I mean, is it sound? Yeah. Well, this is so loud. Oh, okay, maybe not with that. <laughs> now we add our half a cup of water and a, a teaspoon of salt, and it's hot water. Hot blood. Hot water. And then we add this to our baggie, and then we're gonna mush again. We wanna make sure we try and get all that, all that mushed in there. Oh, the banana banana. We love bananas. We love bananas, right? Bananas are good. Yeah, you like eating them? I just want a piece too. You want to eat some banana? Yeah, I want to eat. I just want to put add in my water. You want, you want to add some banana to your water? Okay. There you go. Good job. Okay, so we mush this for about 45 seconds. I'm losing my lab assistant. Well, you're getting a new 
Oh, so I'm getting a new one. Emma, go in. Emma, you want to come over here? So you can be in the video. And you want to be on the video? Out. You want to help? Yeah. All right, here, come over here. You want me to? I'll take this off. All right. Oh, I'm gonna hold on. We're gonna bring you a whole new suit. We're gonna move that out of the way. Can you sit in this one? Okay. Why don't you come and join me then? Okay. So we're doing an experiment. Manny, can someone call Manny? Manny, come here. <laughs> There's like a, there's some chicken. You can give him that chicken. Mickey, I'm oh, Mickey. Manny. There we go. Okay, Ems. So we mushed up a banana in this bag. Oh. And then we added water to it to mush it even more. Yeah. And then now. It looks like melted butter. It does look like melted butter. Now. Is that soap? Yeah, now we're going to add some soap. We're going to add a teaspoon of soap. Why? So what we're trying to do is get the DNA. What's DNA? DNA is this material that's found in all of your cells. So you're made up of a bunch of cells and there's DNA in your cells and it contains the instructions for how to make you. So it has the instructions for what color hair you're gonna have or what color eyes you'll have. We all have DNA. Now, can you help me? Can you open the top up here? Mm -hmm. I can open it. Okay, thank you. So we are adding. Yeah, I Oh, good job. So we're going to add this dishwashing soap. Can I put it in? Yeah. You want to? Oh, beautiful. It looks like a beautiful color. It does look like a beautiful color. So we put that in and now we want to mix it, blue. but we want to mix it really gently because we don't want to make a lot of bubbles. So we're just going to slowly mix. You want to help? You can just push down like that. Yeah, good job. Yeah, it's nice and warm, right? Okay. We'll mix it a little bit, we'll do a little bit like this. We'll try not to make so many bubbles. We want to make sure it's in there. All right, so hopefully this is breaking up those cells that I talked about. Almost is done. Almost done. Almost done. Uh -huh. Okay, mommy. Yeah, I'm just charging it. I'll be right back. Okay, so... Are you going to make that different color? I don't think it's going to go any more colors. I think it's going to stay this kind of yellowish. <laughs> but what we're going to do next... <laughs> is we're going to pour this in here. Oh. Yeah, so this is a coffee filter. Uh, and... We're gonna try and make sure this coffee filter doesn't move when I pour that in. So that might be your job to hold it a bit. Ready? Okay, so we are gonna now pour our contents into here. Boop. Right? Oh, it's still a little yeah, I put them in there. Might have to, okay, you can let go. But you can just so we're going to wait a little bit yeah. for that, all the water to drip down, because that's what we want. Mm -hmm. So we might have to wait a couple minutes. So I'm going to pause this video, all right? Okay, so we had a couple mishaps, but at the end, you should have your banana liquid at the bottom of your glass. And the last step is to add about an inch of alcohol. Now this is isopropyl alcohol and it should be cold. So I've had it in the freezer for a couple hours. And you wanna add it slowly so it forms a nice layer on the top. Okay, so if you look, oh, you can see it there. You can see the alcohol layer up on the top right here. And now you're gonna wait a couple more minutes. So I'll restart this in about 10 minutes.